Looking from your telescope, take me on this journey home. I don't wanna wait no. Hey everyone, so as you can see by the title of the video, we're gonna be doing a get ready with me. I think this is gonna be a pretty fun video. It's fun and simple. I don't really do much when I get ready anyway, so I feel like this will be a just a short, simple video. And this was recommended by Dari because she said I should just do a get ready with me where I just sit in front of the camera, talk, and just do my makeup i'm currently in my class right now but it's about to end and she already checked up on me so i don't really have to worry about it anyways let's get started so i have my makeup bag here with me right now this is the makeup bag i use it's from the brand darbney lee and it just has cute little cactuses I'm a plant mom, okay? I love plants, so this was literally perfect for me. I don't have a mirror in front of me. I'm in front of my window, so we're gonna use the Take Me To Ibiza makeup palette. Dari, my best friend, actually got me this for my birthday. So we're gonna use this because it has a mirror on it. How pretty these colors are. Oh my goodness, they're stunning. I freaking love this palette. It's one of my favorite palettes because of just the colors and the color combinations brilliant anyway so i already actually did my eyebrows off screen because eyebrows are very tricky and difficult for my eyebrows i use the instant lift pro pencil by l and i believe this is in brown or deep brown one of the two the next thing i use is blush and again i use the brand elf as you can see and this is the color blushing so that's the one i use this is my first time. Elf went in my mom's room. Elf! Elf! My makeup is very simple. I need to go out and buy a foundation. Um, I normally only do like heavy makeup when I'm going out for like parties or I have something going on. Um, but I don't really, with this pandemic guys, who is really going out to like parties like that? And I need to find another one because I used to borrow the one that my mom had, but I gave it to her because sometimes she uses light makeup, a little foundation just to cover up. And I gave it to her, I gave it back to her because I actually stole it. And now I don't have one. I want to try Selena Gomez's um, makeup brand. I think it's Rare Me, Rare Beauty rare beauty one of those but i really want to try it out because i believe her makeup is vegan cruelty free and i've always supported selena gomez i feel like she has just come such a long way okay it's enough of blush i always told dari that the only reason why i probably would never make these is because i don't know what to talk about like my life is not that interesting uh for highlight i also use the elf highlight i think elf is like my favorite makeup product and this is in the shade white gold but i always told her that i would never make these because i don't know what to talk about i don't know what to talk about or like how you should do it i feel like when people are makeup gurus they just talk about their day or like their life and i'm like what do i do well today is friday finally friday am i right guys this is probably going to be going up on wednesday though or saturday but i think it's going to go up on wednesday i have work today at three yay me i'm not excited i'm just like bored but the good thing is that i don't i don't i did not get a lot of homework assigned today so i think i'm actually finally gonna have like a weekend to myself well not to myself but like i mean like a weekend where i don't have to stress about doing homework or not going out because i have homework to do because last weekend it was horrible i am in ib english and i had to do my freaking interactive oral where basically is a 15 minute presentation oral presentation uh, that we have to give and then like the first 10 minutes is just you describing your topic and then the next the last five minutes is like all in the air basically the teacher just asks you questions regarding your topic and you just have to think of it off the stuff uh, off the stuff off the spot on like on the spot so that weekend was the worst weekend all i was doing that weekend was literally like practicing me saying it over and over and over and trying to memorize it but i got it done thankfully i have another one for spanish i think next week or in two weeks before our spring break starts so i'm not too happy about that but i'm pretty sure it's pretty simple so it's not bad 
at this moment I'm like yeah my makeup is pretty much done this is all I do and but but we could do a little bit of eyeshadow but do I want to is the question all right for this get ready with me we're gonna be doing some eyeshadow I have the Maybelline New York baby skin instant pore eraser so I'm gonna use this on my eyelids it looks like this um, oh interesting story i was never into makeup it literally took me forever to get into makeup and i never was really into it like even getting into like wearing mascara was like such a problem because i always thought that it like i feel like whoever hasn't been into makeup before and then starts doing makeup like even mascara it just feels like your eyelashes are so heavy and i felt like i would get my eyelids like closed <laughs> That's literally how I felt. I think it's been like over um, two years now that I've gotten into makeup. My first makeup palette was um, the Shane Dawson and Jeffrey Conspiracy palette. That was my first um, ever makeup palette and that was when I was actually going out of my comfort zone and I was doing makeup and I even wore like a really um, bright, hopefully you can't hear the wind. It's unless you can hear the wind. Anyway, what I was saying, I even did like a bright pink, um, a bright pink look one time and I wore it to school and I was shocked because I just never do things like that. So it was, I was really like out there for me and I was like, oh, no, thank you. But I feel like it definitely helped. And then this palette, like I said, it's take me to Ibiza. I just like have fallen out of like makeup and like doing my eyeshadow and stuff and then Dari got that for my birthday and it kind of inspired me to start doing my makeup I feel like I should just do makeup because I like it and just to get ready because it's always fun just to get ready so her buying me this makeup palette actually really helped like kind of spark that joy again I guess you can say and wanting to wear makeup or wanting to do the makeup looks so thank you Dari for doing that because I really did fall out of makeup since I have a uh, work later I think I'm gonna be doing like a more on the lighter side makeup no bright makeup I'm gonna be doing this color right here and this one as the base and this one's gonna be at like it's like more glittery so I'm gonna be doing those two colors it's really hard to see on camera I'm gonna be putting the base on first and then the glitter is gonna go out here which I think is like the outer outer eye hopefully i'm right correct me if i'm wrong i honestly i think one of my favorite videos that i've posted so far on my channel is my very first vlog because it was all fun and i had dari in it and it was just good vibes and it was and it was just fun my favorite thing about my vlogs is that you can really see that i'm so bad at like talking and a lot of you guys point that out that i'm bad at talking and i don't know what i'm saying um, speaking of not talking, my mom actually suggested that I should make a vlog or like a video in Spanish and see how that turns out. And I actually really like that idea. I think it's a very interesting and I feel like it's going to be really fun to film because you will literally see the struggle I have not only speaking Spanish, but I mean, it's just a combination of me not being able to speak Spanish and a combination of me not being able to even speak in my own videos in English. So I think it will be really funny if I make that, that little, um, that little video, you know, speaking in Spanish, a vlog in Spanish. I think that's what I'm going to end up doing. Let me know if you guys like that idea, but I think I'm going to do it because I actually really like the idea. I actually have to go pick up my sister today, so we'll see what she says about my makeup. I've been really enjoying just picking up my sister and dropping her off. I feel like it gives me something to do. Not only does it, like, take me out of the house, but I feel like it... I don't know, I just feel responsible. I feel like a sister. I just put the base on and now I'm about to put the glitter. One thing I really want to get good at is putting on like my eyeshadow and my like, m yeah, my eyeshadow with the finger. I know a lot of people can do their makeup with just like their fingers and I think that's very cool. I feel like I got very lucky with um, getting all my things makeup wise because Dari she literally gave me like 
her makeup that she didn't need anymore and she didn't like use or she didn't like anymore or like she just found um what fits for her so she gave me all like all of that makeup when I first started I literally saved so much money because when you start makeup like all of my brushes that I have and like the concealers that I have or I think I know she gave me a foundation too to try like I literally got to do all that and try it for free like I didn't have to shop for a brand like a whole brand new things to test them out or anything they were all free and then I spent money to test them out once I kind of figure out what I liked and what I didn't like I saved no money all right so I just finished um, like fixing it up right now so this is how it ended up looking on camera it's looking more like orangey but it's more like a, it looks more like a coral pink like a dark coral pink not orange so I don't know why it's coming off as orange and there the church bell started so hopefully you can't hear that anyway then the last thing I pretty much do is I'm just taking like the white the white eyeshadow sorry that was my phone the white eyeshadow right here and I'm just gonna oh my gosh what the all right my mom just needed me to um answer her the door I just take the lightest one and I just literally put that right in my inner corner I feel like it just gives a little more pop I don't know so that's how it looks now just added the little sparkle I don't know it just gives like a touch it just gives a little touch okay since I just finished my eyeshadow I'm going to finish it off with putting on mascara and I use the uh, elf eye enhancing mascara it looks like this right here and this one actually has like little uh, sparkles on it it has like glitter on it so I really like it this mascara was actually recommended by Lulu so shout out to Lulu because I really enjoy this mascara I was looking for a mascara a while ago and she told me that I should try the elf one and so I did and I've been with it ever since and I actually really enjoy it and I think the little sparkles are really cute because it's just sparkly okay sometimes you need a little sparkle in your life Ooh, tip if you have like waterproof mascara or mascara that's really hard to take off i definitely recommend using like coconut oil to take it off because it will easily slide off and you won't be there rubbing your eye and irritating your eye and pulling off mascara i mean pull, pulling off eyelashes and the good thing about it too is that they say that i think they say coconut oil can help like lengthen them or strengthen them one of those so it's a win-win I filmed a get ready with me um, in the last vlog but I did not like how it turned out so and in that get ready with me I put my mascara on first and then I did my eyeshadow and it just looked really bad I think it's almost time to go pick up my sister and perfect timing because we're pretty much done with my makeup look to seal it all off i use the elf illuminating mist set it looks like this i use this to set my face so we're gonna quickly do that i'm running out now i'm sad all right guys i hope you enjoyed this get ready with me this is my first ever get ready with me so i hope you enjoyed i do really simple makeup and i literally only did my eyeshadow for you guys so i hope you enjoyed and i'm gonna end this video now and i can't wait to see you in my next video don't forget to like comment subscribe <laughs> i'll see you next time bye